Hi there, I'm Justin Pritchard for Driving.ca and this video is all about headlights and specifically how the technology behind them keeps getting better and better even in some of the most affordable cars on the road. So we'll take a look at what's behind that trend, what it means for your nighttime drive, and I'll be sharing plenty of footage to show you what a high performance lighting system looks like today in 2020 and best of all, it's probably cheaper than you think. A car's headlight performance is a vital part of its safety and driver comfort, but most drivers never actually try them out before buying. Good headlights can make all the difference if you're frequently out and about after dark. And on a long nighttime drive, the performance of your car's lighting system can play a major role in safety, alertness, eye fatigue, and overall driver well-being. Personally, I like a lighting system that looks like this, and you're on board the new Mercedes A220. You'll notice the light is pure white, thickly covers the road, and reaches into the tree lines and culverts, which is very important if you live somewhere like me in Northern Ontario, where wildlife is a big deal. And the reach of the headlights is pretty far, but you can see the beam is sliced cleanly off to keep it low to the road so that you won't get other drivers flashing you. And here we can see strong engagement of the reflective signs up the road. And overall, the effect of these attributes put together is that the driver feels more alert, is doing less straining to see detail far up the road, and overall your eyes just feel and perform better. Now your eyes might be different than mine, but my favorite thing about a lighting system like this is that even after hours in the dark, I arrive where I'm going and my eyes don't feel strained and tired and like I just rubbed them full of sand. What I'm trying to leave you with here is that a good set of lights can make a massive difference to your overall well-being as a driver if you're out and about after dark. And good news because lighting this good is getting more and more affordable. In fact, I showed you this Mercedes A220 on purpose because it's the least expensive Mercedes in Canada and it still has lighting system performance like what you used to expect on something a lot pricier. And it doesn't need to be a premium brand either. Nissan Kicks, Chevrolet Silverado, Hyundai Sonata, Ford Mustang. All of these have left me with a very good impression of their lighting system on recent test drives, specifically by giving me that same list of attributes that I love about a high-end lighting system. This Wrangler had an LED lighting package available, $995 on my tester, and with it, I'd say this was easily top 10 best headlights I've ever used, and there have been hundreds. And the Corolla or Prius, both of these run LED technology headlights as standard equipment, and both give you excellent lighting performance that wouldn't look out of place up the road in front of a high-end luxury crossover. Like the XC60 or this XT6, if you're spending this kind of money today, these are also some fantastic lighting systems. But if you're not spending the money, you've still got great affordable options with more incoming regularly. So what's behind this trend? Well, maybe it's the safety scores. Those sell cars, after all, and today certain coveted safety ratings that shoppers look for require the car to achieve top marks in crash protection, structural and restraints, but also a top mark for its headlights. Beyond that, LED headlights are energy efficient, which is the way to go these days, and that's another reason you can expect to see this trend stick around. Well, that's about it for this video. Hopefully you found that information to be useful and maybe even illuminating. My name's Justin Pritchard for driving.ca. Until next time, take care and drive safe. We'll see you in the next video.